Donkey years since Romeo and Juliet, there was Tilly and Ska. Yeah, but this was an island thing. Between an uptown girl and a boy from the ghetto. Ska, like most fellas around here, have many options. The job was simple. Break your nice. Not looking like a sucker back breast. Tell them yet. It's all types of breasts. So. It's all long breasts. It's all round breasts. It's all raising breasts. Upside eyes. Williams! That's what I'm playing for? Now, sir, just brushing up on these skills. Trying something new. You want to try something new? I break it in with a fucking shuffle. The move! Yes, I see you, boy. Come. If you don't like it, there are real opportunities out there, you know. Watch, man. You have a construction worker. You have a gardener. You have garbage, man. You have a nuts, man. You have a desert man who's putting nuts in the bag. Is that the man who's putting nuts? I was just taking some extra time to teach myself some. <laughs> you take extra time? <laughs> Alright, we'll take extra time. Take a week! <laughs> no pay! No pay? Yes! Take a week, no pay! Tell me what I teach you. Tilly, on the outside, was the average uptown 19-year-old girl. She just had a little trouble with fire. fire, 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 fire. Save your money for some pies now. Uh, I feel. Scott, we got it. You can't clean mass if you're free of powder. But Scott was taking time off. How to do what you had to do. The Maryland State has at its head a president since 19. Miles away from Tilly's four star shots. This was El Socorro. Nice Spanish for the help. The motto was walk, eat, sleep, and repeat. Men used to rock a little place called Niceness. Nice where the working class used to go online. But the dance floor was Paco Dan. Was calling itself the cleanup crew. Real tradesman, security guard, maid, seamstress. Gunman was up in there too. Some go say it full of broken clock. <laughs> well, a, a broken clock is still getting time right. At least two time a day. Eh? And that school ball was right on the fucking time way. Well, he is got a hard too. Let me explain.
You're going to be late for your lessons. Earl has spent plenty of money on those Spanish classes. Act with a sense of urgency. I'll be there in a second. I'm not headed to Mexico next week. Now, it wasn't a suggestion. For God's sake, don't you think it appropriate to wear a swimsuit? For what reason? Modesty was made by man, so I won't have to remain a wreck all day. <laughs> I prefer the way Jesus made me. I thought when we left your father, you would have left that mouth behind. I thought he left, now it's collateral damage. Oh, God. Last time I see a man jump, so you somebody money. You're coming late. I don't want to wake you. Everything all right? All good. Mm. Need some money. Ah. <laughs> I thought you were saving. Uh huh. Yeah. <clears throat> This is my last 10 until pension check day. Uh, how much money have I saved? About $16. 16. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you check out the security guard work? I know I am retired, but um, I have friends down at the sugarcane plant, you know. Um, and Mr. Paul pays well. He gave plenty of people from my family uh, work down there. You know. uh, they paid for this house. It's good work, son. Good work? After 30 years, all he gave is a small black and white TV and an old lamp for retirement. That's what you call good work? It's mine. Sorry, Pop. I just meant it. No, 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 don't beat up, son. I understand. <laughs> An old man's comfort is not a young man's dream. Tired. Aboard, Pops. I want to see something I never seen before. See something I never seen before. Hmm. All of, all of you just plan life, son. But you play the hand that you are dealt, eh? I'm sure they thought of the last night. What? Better. Seen something you've never seen before. Hmm. <laughs> so, Scar went off to find whatever he was looking for. See something new. But the devil had a next plan in the cover that day. Short man and big man. Did they say when them men come through busing, everybody catching it from pillar to post? Pillar is the small fella and post is the big man. Me and know how them work out that between the two of them. Through cemetery. Tilda Pip, daughter of Mr. Gregory Pip and Amelia Pip, 1919 to 1964. So I'm named after you. Hi, Grandma. I wonder who you are. No one ever tells me anything. step forward. 
tell me your name and your age and one thing about you that I might find slightly interesting. My name is Cassandra Charles. I'm 21 years old and I graduated from Holy Child year 77. <sighs> Convent girl. No wonder you smile so hard. It's a pity they don't teach personality back in line. You, step forward. Matilda Arkwright, 19 years old. I'd rather climb a tree than be here, but my mother insists on finding new and improved ways to spend her husband's money. Well, dog have bitch to bite. Pack in line. And that bitch should have teeth marks all down the back of her legs. <laughs> Let me remind you girls. In here, I am not looking for regular. I'm not here to make you feel better about yourselves. Babies and monkeys are cute. Everyone else has to work for it. I'm looking for a girl that can shine across the globe. A girl that other girls look at and want to be like. Now she may be here, but I don't know. Never think you're irreplaceable. You could always end up where former beauty queens go. <laughs> to die. British West Indian Airlines? If you can pour a cup of Coca-Cola, darling, you're hired. Half a man, John who is a fuck a fucking dollar, you know. Five doubles now, you know. Fifty cents was five fucking doubles. You see where they're going on now? <laughs> you can imagine the price of a girl now. Eh, eh. Watch him now. Fucked up my Sanyo. Do you need special glasses or something? Who even goes for an evening run in the friggin' cemetery? Well, what kind of girl has come to the cemetery in the night? What are you doing here? Minding my own business. Oh, mind my own business. Something you could try. Get behind me. I see a different scene play out by La Perouse that day. For one, Scar was a runner. One no fighter. Nah, that's too good for you. And me, me and even know if them was prepared for what will happen next. <laughs> yeah, the man was free. Couldn't even move it to eyeball. Again, you look like fire to my brain. I can't forget your name. 